it's Britta and Jeff from Best Tops Marketing Department again. We're shooting another video today, but this time we're in beautiful Moab. Moab's a great place to talk about these Best Top bumpers because these bumpers are really made for tough off-road conditions. Desktop's High Rock 4x4 bumpers are available for TJs and for JKs. Actually, we make them for YJs as well, going back to 1986. Uh, people can just go to bestop.com to find the exact bumper for their Jeep. Excellent. Good point. Let's talk about the TJ one. All right. So this is the high access bumper, and this is really designed to give you the ultimate in ground clearance. What you're after with the bumper is that it still provides protection, but gives you all of the clearance that you need so that you can get that really good approach angle. The idea behind one of these bumpers that's made for extreme off-road conditions is that it still protects all the bodywork on your Jeep, which is really one of the main functions of a bumper, but gets out of the way so that you can go over incredibly tall obstacles. And this one, as you can see, is really angled up, and then it comes down to follow the body lines of your Jeep. So our high access bumper here is black powder coat and it also has a wrinkle finish. Um, it's 3 16 inch laser cut steel so it's really heavy duty. You can bang up on the rocks and you're not going to damage your bumper. These are actually very heavy, very solid bumpers. So we have a couple options you can add on to your High Rock 4x4 bumper. The first one is the tubular grill guard which is this piece right here. You can get it in black or you can get it in stainless steel. This bolts right in. So it's very easy to install if you decide to go with that option. And it also has these welded on tabs to mount your lights. The winch plate is this L-shaped bracket and it goes right in between the bumper and your winch. It gives you a little bracket right here to mount your roller fair lead to. And then it goes right over to these pre-drilled holes. And that gives you a very easy, quick way to mount up a winch. Another cool feature of our bumper is it has mounts here for your D-ring. You can buy these as well and they give you a great point pull yourself out of a tough spot or help someone else out. A lot of clubs won't even let you go on a trail run if, unless you have a front extraction point. So you need to get something like this. And this is a really good way of doing it. It's, it's quick, it's easy. We also have mounts for what we call is our approach roller. We don't have one on this Jeep, but we're actually going to step on over to our JK and show you what that looks like. This is the approach roller. It mounts right here on these roller bearings. It's really a clever idea. What happens is if you come up on a large rock, it just eases it right up and over. It also makes your angle really nice to avoid damaging some of the more tender bits underneath your Jeep. All right, so we just showed you that approach roller, and that is connected to the front bumper here, which is the other option. It's not the high axis. It's our other bumper shown on our JK. It's available for YJs, TJs, and JKs. You can see that this one is angled slightly differently here, but still pulls up on the corners really high because that approach angle is really important to us with these bumpers. It's still got a tough, heavy-duty powder coat finish with a wrinkle finish as well, and it has all the same options that we just showed you on the high axis bumper. The other option we haven't shown you yet is our bumper box, our bumper storage box, which Jeff has here, mounts to the front of any of our front bumpers. Um, it also can go on the rear bumpers, so it's going to attach real easily just like this. It's meant to store and hold a high lift jack and any other winch accessories you want to put in there, um, and you can even lock it with a padlock. We also have two styles of rear bumpers. This is the one that's made for JK, so any Jeep from 2007 to now. And you can see that it's really designed to match the front with this faceted wraparound approach. That gives you a lot of protection on these corners, which is really one of the most vulnerable areas. That's really, again, key part of a bumper is keeping this sheet metal nice and straight. So all of our rear bumpers for Jeep 1986 till current Jeeps, actually, are all made with the same materials as the front bumper. On the rear bumper, we also have the D-ring mounts. You can see here, they come with it, um, so you can use that to pull people out. You also get a 2-inch receiver, and that's very useful for a lot more things than you might initially think. 
For example, we sell this recovery receiver hedge, which you can put a D-ring on. It's got the pin to go through the receiver, and that's an excellent extraction point for getting yourself or another cheaper unstuck. And again, you need to have these. All right, we're talking about TJ bumpers, which is the exact same model that you could use on a YJ. So any Jeep from 86 to 2006. So this bumper is still made out of the really heavy duty steel like the others. It also has the powder coat and the wrinkle finish. Um, but on this one, you can see that it has the optional departure roller. You can choose to get it with or without the departure roller tabs. Another cool thing is that it comes with the D-ring mounts here. So thanks for joining us on our video on our Hi-Rack 4x4 bumpers. We're really happy that we have these bumpers that can help get you and your Jeep ready to come enjoy places like beautiful Moab. Getting your Jeep ready for these adventures is really what Best Top's all about. If you want to learn more about our Hi-Rack 4x4 bumpers, just go to bestop.com or talk to any local Best Top authorized dealer installer near you.